So, Alicia, it's very nice to meet you. Likewise. Um, you're here um, for Undine, right. which you play the title role in Neil Jordan's new film. Um, could you tell us a little bit about how you came to play it and what your experiences was in the role? Right. Um, well, I believe that Neil Jor Jordan, he's he seen some of my work, my previous movies, and um, um, he reached out to me. He wanted to meet me. Um, and um, we had a little chat in London, and then I, I, I came to Dublin for a few days. Uh, then I met the little Alison, and we played around a bit uh, with some lines. And I think that's that, that how it worked. Um, now, you know, reading the script, I was just enchanted by it, I'm just totally uh, captivated by it, the magic and... Um, the mystery of, of, of the story, so I was really looking forward to, to, to doing it. And the, when, you, when you talk about mystery and enchantment, like the, the, the role that you play, it's a very mysterious character. Right. But I found myself when I was watching it, so I believed you, you know what I mean? E even though Good. there was the mystery there, I'm willing, I want it to be true. Right. The, the whole fairy tale, yeah. I found myself engaged in it and you, you, you want it to be true. You, know, right. you feel it that way. It's sort of Definitely. you're willing the impossible, and I think you do that very well. That comes across very oh, well. Thank in your, you so much. In the way you that, play it. Thank you, thank you very much. That was, um, you know, that that was an interesting task as a as an actor to to kind of lead those two different personalities or different, you know, personas in in one, and and, and as well playing her in a way that that I'm truthful and and faithful to my character, but at the same time I kind of keep the the mystery and the and the fairy tale going for myself and for the viewer, right? So it was interesting. It was a it was a challenge. And when you talk about your um, the way working with um, Alison, Alison right. Barry, uh, obviously that relationship is crucial to right. the film yeah. uh, because well, that your character it's it's allowed to prolong that mystery because of Alison and what she puts into the relationship. Definitely. What was it like working with her, especially because, from what I hear, she, she was just taken from school and put into this role right, in the middle of everything, but comes across fantastic. fantastic. It gives a great performance. She, she was very real and natural and, and quite, um, you know, what I've seen in the movie, she was, she was very much like that, very fresh, very curious, v quite straightforward, um, not entirely shy, which is great mm. because that's a quality that kids have, or I, I don't want to say kids because maybe she's a lady already and, and she'll get offended. But she was, um, she, you know, she was very lovely and refreshing on the set, and it was it was great to create that relationship, that friendship between us, and we did create a little, you know, a little bond between uh, me and her, and and, and and as well Undine and Annie and Alison and, and Alicia which comes across in the film. Um, what I wanted to say about the, was it the Alice in Wonderland as well, the curious and curiouser. Right. And I just love the way that line is played in the film. Yes. I think everybody says it at some stage, do they? I think um, Alison says it, you right. say it, I think um, Syracuse does. says right. it as well. It sort of travels through it, it the does. film, curious and curiouser, which, which is, you know, sort of sums up the film itself. Um, one thing I have to ask you, although it looked, it looks beautiful, Oh. When you're in the sea, <laughs> I know and when, where you're going. when you come up in the net, right. surrounded by fish, but how was it? Difficult. Yes. Mm -hmm. It was very Suff cold. Suffering for your art. It, it, yes. Um, yes, I have to say it was a bit of suffering, and 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 you know you can find pleasure in that as well, and it suits art many times. Suffering is a great tool. This time. It was a bit an obstacle as well, you know, it, it just, the cold itself limits the flexibility of, of the, not only your physical body, but as well kind of, you know, you're kind of more detached, we're, and especially because it was really, really cold. Uh, at some point, I think it was eight degrees, the water itself. Okay. So everybody on the set was afraid of me getting hy hypothermia, and I actually got a, a hint of it. Um, but, um, you know, I mean, it was um, it, it was challenging, and, and many times I can't even recognize my face because I'm quite swollen from the cold. Right. 
but at the same time, you know, that was the story. And, and, and as much as, as I didn't want to show that it's cold, and that that obstacle helped me out many times to to just, you know, go different place, okay. go, go, go to a bit different uh, place in my, you know, may, maybe physical body, but but it, it just it just it, it, it was a tool. It was so a tool. In, in a way, you're discovering more about the character by having to go through that in itself. Probably. I mean, the character went through a lot, and maybe if she was m maybe more, you know, acquainted with swimming and, and kind of rough treatment as a character, her, her past is, is very difficult. Okay. So, so um, I, I kind of invented all the past for, for the character, and she went th through a lot. But um, so she says that was almost a relief to actually be in, that, in, in, in those waters and actually be dying. And I could imagine that. <laughs> I could imagine that. While being in, while you know, while being in those cold, cold waters. Well, I hope there was always someone on hand with a, a hot whiskey or some sort of hot rum. No drinking or, on the set. No, not at all. E even for medicinal reasons. I, I won't. No, I. Well, not for me at least. <laughs> okay. Um, You're in Ireland. What do you expect? No. What can you do? Was, was it your? Had you been to Ireland before? What was no, your relationship was with first, Ireland? It was your first time. It was, was my it? first experience uh, with Ireland, Ireland, and and especially Irish um, nature. Which is uh, extraordinary. It's such a strong character. It's, mm. um, I, I spent some 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 time by myself. Really, I had a little cottage on the beach while shooting the movie, and and I could really appreciate um, everything that nature ha had to offer. And in Castle Tumber and th those areas, it has to offer a lot. So it does, yeah. That's so so is, you know. um, so it, it it was very spiritual experience for me as well. Um, as a person, and I, I, I feel it gave me so much. I mean, I, I just really, I became somebody a bit different as well. You know, I kind of felt that that impact on me. So it was um, it was great, and I will I will be back.